When you want answers, when you get your oracle cards out, it's so natural to just dive straight in. You pick your cards up and you start shuffling and you might ask many different questions. Sometimes, you know, what's the what's your message today? What do I need to know today? And that can create um, a shaky foundation for your oracle card readings. If you spend the first three minutes working out what you really want to know, what you're interested in finding out about, then you'll find your oracle card readings, whatever you do next, will be completely transformed. Because if you just take a minute to work out what you want to know, starting by focusing on an area of your life, you'll find that not only will you be excited about the reading, not only will you start to see how the Wisdom Method can provide an amazing structure for all your readings, but most importantly, you're going to get really accurate guidance. And in addition to that, you're going to be able to really develop your intuition because that's what Oracle Card Academy is about. It's about helping you to develop what I call pitch perfect intuition so that you can really hear, you can really see, you can really receive the guidance um, that is going to help you in your life. So this first three minutes of every Oracle card reading, before you get your Oracle cards out, before you touch them, the first three minutes of every Oracle card reading are a chance for you to just sit and just consider, what is it that I want to know? What area of my life is it that is either causing me stress or creating problems or making me feel anxious? What is What area of my life is it that is keeps showing up, you know, creating difficulty? That's one, because one angle of coming at, working out what you really want, because sometimes it is your problems that help you to, that you want to solve, that help you to identify what it is that you're interested in knowing about. And as we go through this, I'm going to help you to understand how the problem is the place that can help you to work out what you really want. But we're not asking about problems ever. Because the way I want to teach you to read cards is what can I do or how can I? It's empowering. It involves you in the process. 